Many of the federal court-ordered benchmarks for improvements at the Department of Mental Health and Substance Abuse are being met. The department's new director, Dr. David Shimizu, says his staff have finally moved patients out of a dilapidated group home in accordance with the federal district court's orders. And a fire suppression system is finally being installed in the department's main facility. Moreover, the department has also removed the mold from its building's ventilation system. The court-ordered improvements come as the result of a lawsuit over the department's failure to provide adequate services to people with disabilities. I'm looking at the whole department in terms of, you know, the quality of the environment. You know, it's got to look like immaculate in terms of it being a hospital, a mental hospital. So uh, we're moving in that direction. But at least one milestone has yet to be reached. That is mental health's merger with the Department of Integrated Services for individuals with disabilities a move that will require the passage of Bill 77 in the legislature. We already had a public hearing. Uh, it's a matter now of maybe doing a markup, taking into account what the public uh, comments, uh, and then come in and uh, prepare it for uh, uh, a review and change and submit it to the uh, uh, full body uh, for passage. Shimizu added the appearance of the department's main building is also getting a facelift with some new coats of paint and other improvements to its conditions. Stefan Sebastian, PNC News.